Hello there, happy summer. Um, your Friday here, and I went to LA Pride last week, and look what I got. Do -do -do! It's really exciting. They're usually like not eight dollars, and I got mine for eight dollars. I'm sorry, I look like a hot mess today, but it's summertime, and I don't give a fuck. <laughs> okay, well, let me lay down because I am outside, as you can tell, just relaxing in my bathing suit bottoms and cute little gay shirt. So this week we are discussing a bunch of stuff. What the hell are we discussing? Okay, first question. Have you ever cheated? If so, do you think it's possible to change or is it a reoccurring habit for you? I've never cheated. I've been cheated on. But um, yeah, I've never cheated ever and I think it's stupid. And um, I think that you should give the person you're with the respect at least to like, I don't know like stay with them and be be what's that word <laughs> you know commit yourself to them and just oh, what the fuck's the word if you're in a monogamous relationship i think you should stay in a monogamous relationship and respect that and if you want to cheat or if you if you have the feeling of cheating then at least woo, respect the other person and just be like um hey like i don't think this is working out i want to see other people and then go on your way and move on yeah. Okay. How do you feel about the recent media coverage about the gay community? Um, what is EastEnders, Coronation Street, and Skins? Okay, I've heard of Skins, but I don't know what the rest of them are. Um, I think, <laughs> I don't know. I haven't heard anything. The only thing I'm hearing, like, gay-wise, is, like, about pride and everything. And, um, um, you know, the L word. The real L word is in couple days, two days, something like that. So I'm excited. Yeah. Um, in the recent show of Girls Kissing Girls in music videos, do you think it has negative or positive effect towards the gay community? Like Tamo and Poker Face. Uh, I like it. Well, <laughs> personally for me, I really like it. I think it's really nice to watch. But um, that's just because I'm a perv. But um, anyways, I don't know. Like, I think it's I think it's exciting. It's expressing. I mean, like, we well, we already know that, like, Lady Gaga is bisexual, and she totally embraces her sexuality. And Rihanna, I know that she admires women, and she loves women's bodies, and thinks they're beautiful, and blah, blah, blah. But um, I don't know if she has been in a relationship with a woman. But I, if, I don't know. It kind of has to do with their reasonings. If they're doing it to get more attention, then maybe. If they're not, then... Um, and they're just being true to their feelings, then go for it. I mean, congratulations. Anyways, um, okay, so this question is basically asking me if um, I'm happy with Lady Gaga's most recent production, Alejandro, and because it's like trying to convert like um, church and LGBT, and basically I didn't even like the video. I am a huge Lady Gaga fan. I've bought every single one of her music videos that she's ever made, except for Alejandro, because I did not like it at all. I just, I don't, I understand the meaning. I get that. Shasta! I don't know what my dog's doing. Oh, well. Um, I didn't like the Alejandro video. I don't really want to talk about it, because I just, I didn't grasp the concept, and I feel like I can't give an opinion on it. Um, what would you do if you knew you were 100% gay, but your parents' whole family were homophobic? Oh, that's a good question. Because I recently just came out, fully came out, like, what's up, mommy and daddy? I only like girls. And there's no, no boys, not gonna happen, sorry, I can't. I just, it's not working. So, um, they're just like, oh, okay, and my dad, my dad doesn't really get it. My dad's a baby boomer, so, um, he kind of doesn't, he's not comfortable talking about it, and so he's tried to, like, be, he tried to, like, relate with me on a level, and it's like, oh, you know, like, my friends, when they turn gay, I'm like, you mean came out? No, when they turn gay, blah, 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 I'm like, no, dad, that's, that's not how it works. So, um, yeah, I don't know, I think... I'm, I'm going to have a problem with some of the my family members on my dad's side because they're super Christian and his dad's super Catholic. And basically I told myself, like, grandparents will not know. I refuse to tell my grandparents because they will not talk to me. And I just, I'm just not comfortable. So I hope you guys can respect that. Um, anyways, uh, 
but as far as my aunts and uncles, I'm very selective of who knows. I'm pretty sure my my aunt, one of my aunts knows because she just kind of spies on my Facebook and everything. So, pretty sure she knows. Um, I'm okay with it. She loves she loves the homos. But other than that, I think I'm just gonna have to adapt to who I tell and all that jazz. So. Anyways, I'm hungry. I'm going to go make myself a sandwich and enjoy this beautiful summer day. And if you get a chance, go to AmericanPearl.com and buy this really exciting legalized gay shirt. Wow, I look fat there. And, um, yeah, buy it. Support us. Poor people in California that can't marry our loved ones. So, yeah, I hope you have a fantastic Friday, a great weekend. Lay out in the sun like I am about to after I eat a sandwich. So, um, have a fantastic Friday, little rainbows. I love you. Bye. Hi, Shasta. Do you guys want to see my dog? Let's see if you can see her. That's my dog. She's cute.